It's a charitable event between police officers and firemen. They're going to be having exhibition boxing matches with the goal of raising money and, and the two departments doing that together. Um, officer Fernetton actually came up with the idea. He used to be an officer in uh, Illinois, and St. Louis does this every year. And it's a big event. I think they're in our 17th or 18th year of doing it. And so he approached me and asked if we'd be interested in doing it. And uh, it, it's just taken off. It's going to be pretty pretty good contest, I think, because, you know, usually they go like two or three minutes in boxing, and this is going to be one minute, but, I mean, one minute in boxing is like five minutes in, you know, any other kind of sport. It's, it's really tough, and a lot of high aerobic workout, but uh, I think they'll be ready, you know, to go one minute rounds, and I think they'll all do well. It's... It's tough because you're using parts of your body you never used before. You know, you get hit, you get hit in the face, and and uh, you know it's just something that's not natural. But uh, it, you know, like I say, it, it's it's I don't I don't I, there's probably not I have a new respect for boxers because there's probably not a, be, a better conditioned athlete in the world than a boxer after seeing what they have to go through, and they go through it a lot higher level than what we are. Um, it's impressive seeing this many guys that are getting this into it and really want to do it, and, and for the right reasons. And it's definitely not anything that we're going to hold a grudge over. It's fun, but you know, there's and when you're looking for somebody to help raise money for charity, there's no better people to ask than policemen and firemen because they're all, they always give in. So it's going to be fun. I think I think it's going to be uh, a lot of good-hearted uh, joking going on, but uh, I, I think it's going to be good for for both the police and fire. I'd, I'd almost guarantee that we sell it out. That just the word of mouth and the way people are talking and the excitement. Um, I think people are going to need to get their tickets before that night because I really expect it to be sold out.